Now in UK cinemas is crime drama The Night of the Twelfth, which won six out of its ten nominations at the Caesars, the French equivalent of the Oscars, including Best Film. Inspired by true events, two detectives are haunted by the unsolved murder of a young woman who was set ablaze. Tonally resembling something like Zodiac, the film focuses on the emotional toll the case has on the investigators who get increasingly frustrated with the deliberately mundane procedural, interrogating the victim's exes, a series of awful, misogynistic men. It's a desperately sad, sombre film that isn't so much a whodunit as they could have all done it. That's the damning social commentary. Despite its acclaim, I was left underwhelmed by this. A third act time jump adds very little, and even given the unresolved nature of the case, the film just stops at a rather peculiar and abrupt moment. It's well directed by Dominic Moll, if rather clinically so, but this is far too cold and bleak for my personal taste. 